We are here yeah, with uh, a man who meet, needs no introduction. If you are a fan of nerdcore, hip hop, we're here with Mega Ran. Yo, it's what's a, up, guys? It's a pleasure to meet you. Thank you so much for it's being on Off be the on Rails. Off the Rails, man. All right, man. I appreciate it. <laughs> Obviously, big fan of the Mega Man games. Are there yeah. any other old school Capcom games? What other favorites do you have? What are the other big ones that influence you? Capcom Bionic Commando. Uh, another cool top-down game they had was called Mercs. I don't know if you remember this. I remember Mercs it was, was a three-player. It was a two-player. Two three and uh, yeah, arcade yeah. was three. Then it was two at home. Right. Um, they put it on Genesis. Super fun, just blasting stuff and getting in the vehicles and shooting everything up. Right. Uh, always love games like that. I got a question though. What you know, before you ran into them, you know, Capcom, and you saw some some influences. What what made you get into rapping? What artist you know turned you on to, to to start doing it in the first place? I was old school with it, so like. Run DMC, nice. Beastie Boys, LL Cool J, um, then moving into like Outkast, um, Tribe Called Quest, Gangstar, uh, Eric B and Rakim, KRS-One. You know, there's a lot of great stuff to be inspired by, but back in the day, Snoop and Dr. Dre, it was Tribe Called Quest. You know, that stuff right there was really what made me get into it nice. to begin with. Yeah, good stuff. Yeah. It was this golden age, wasn't it? That's what they call it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah.